Hello, good morning, sir. Uh, so today I'm here to give about my introduction about myself. Eh? So my name is Kamal Sangi Sherpa. Eh? So I finished my class 12 from St. Javis School, Pakyong, and uh, graduated from SMIT Majidar Manipal. So I finished my teacher training DLA from NIOS, that is National Institute of Open Schooling. So my total years of experience in teaching is almost eight years. My district is East uh, and my state name is Sikkim and I live in Rumtek East Sikkim. So and there is a famous monastery called Rumtek Monastery. So many tourists come to visit from all over the country. So it's located at proper at Rumtek. So uh, it is located at a distance of 20 km, 24 km away from Gangtok. That is a capital capital of Sikkim. So it was built in 16th century by the 9th Karmapa Wongchu. Uh, Rumtek meaning God left the Dharma Chakra Center established and it was established in the year 1714. Coming to the school name where I worked. So my school name is Rumtek Kayanthang Primary School which is located in Rumtek. So the total number of students in our school is 30. Coming to the problem faced while teaching. So the topic is the problem faced while teaching. So the problem while facing the teaching, it means like uh, knowing the uh, students well, understanding the different learning abilities and capabilities of the students, uh, motivating and encouraging them when the students underperform and have to deal with uh, a parental and a pure, pure pressure. The ZIIIA training was started on May, it was, our training was started on May 14, 2021. So obviously, yes sir, it has been uh, very supportive for us that uh, sir has given us a good lessons. He teaches us in a very uh, systematic way, giving and sharing a beautiful knowledge, right? uh, a fruitful knowledge uh, about the ZIIIA training. So. Uh, and he also teaches about uh, our innovative partial right? coming to the IPCT or in, uh, innovative partial training right? coming to a IPCT or innovative partial training so yes uh, innovative partial is uh, very effective so and uh, it is he also helpful for the upcoming generation so since it makes it easier for one to grow and perform effectively role model school so i feel that our school should be uh, selected as role model of each district as every teachers are very punctual and pay full attention right? and uh, and also towards our school education and uh, towards our students education right? Discipl disciplines are maintained uh, in every compound in our school right? uh, it is uh, outside the schools or inside the school uh, curriculum so teachers are very supportive towards the students so every day the teachers used to work very hard to give a fruitful results right, for the students right? and also for the staff members of schools and coordinately they get together like uh, um, they used to share a thoughtful meaningful uh, thing which uh, goes uh, towards the students right so i feel that uh, z double IEI training or ideas can help us our school students by uh, creating good ideas on learning creative and innovative ideas while learning it can be implemented effectively without any additional expenditure right z double IEI training is very uh, creative that give innovative ideas while giving an uh, additional expenditure without any ad additional ex expenditure creating ideas to improve students so lastly not the least i would like to thank about the uh, sri arumanda society uh, our uh, teacher and uh, also uh, giving a lot of thanks giving to our sdfc bank for uh, giving us a i would like to thank uh, like uh, of and also i would like to uh, forward for such fruitful training in future 
and which can be applied in school and towards the students. Right? So lastly, I would like to thank HDFC Bank also. Uh, thank you.